Yowza, 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 bear with me. This is a little long, a little convoluted and personal. Uh, first of all, I want to apologize. I've been sick for, God knows, like three months. And no, I'm not on chemo or anything like that. A wise man, back when I was about 17, told me as I was bitching and moaning about something, he said, are you on chemo? And I said, no. And he goes, then shut the hell up. And I've kind of tried to live that way ever since, whenever possible. Uh, but I've been sick, just uh, trying to convince God to let me live. And they have not been up to par wig outs uh, 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 at least a couple months. Well, I apologize for that. Uh, Riley, who uh, her father attended the last wig out, and that's uh, his daughter, she wanted him to relay to me that uh, the wig outs have been a little subpar lately. And Riley, you're absolutely correct. And thank you for having the, 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 the wherewithal to send a message like that. Thank you very much. Because Riley gave her name. However, for JBUSKO6648, eat me. If you don't have the balls, to put your name on an email where you trash me. All I did was print it out and use it in the bathroom because that was all it was good for. So, pfft. Now, why have I been sick? <clears throat> well, I recently got a foster daughter who uh, just turned one the other day. And she is a Petri dish. If there is a, a cold or something going around, she will get it. And, of course, that goes around in daycare. And I go to the daycare once upon a time who was going to open in this building. Going to open in this building. They had already spent $400,000 in reworking it. It was just a, it was a piece of art for all the, the little kids that go there. And they're a great place. They're a developmental center. But it's not about plugging them. It's talking about they had a lease. A lease with a company that did own the building. I believe their name was C R O O K S. And uh, they absconded with everybody's money, and it's a long story. But the bank Morgan Stanley now owns the building. Morgan Stanley, we care about you. No, Morgan Stanley doesn't care about a damn thing except themselves. This is a bank that for the last decade has been fined about uh, $12 million a year because of their illegalities and uh, screwing people, kind of like Wells Fargo. Well, Morgan Stanley, who now owns the building, has said that they don't want a daycare center in the building. It'll be too hard to sell. They, daycare has a lease. Well, we don't recognize it. We don't want a daycare center in one of our buildings. Who wouldn't want a daycare center in a building? I mean, my God, how easy would that be to come to work and have the kid in daycare just two floors down from you? That's the way a real bank would care about you. But there aren't. I'm having trouble finding real banks. I mean, Wells Fargo just took another hit because their people were opening up phantom accounts in other people's names. When you hear about the bank that cares about you and they want to work with you, remember Morgan Stanley is not one of them. Banks have no interest in anything but your money and taking it from you. Think about all the fees you've got now that you didn't have 10 years ago. It's just not right. Just bringing it up here as we enter the holiday season. Morgan Stanley, you people, is a special place in hell for you. Now, we move on to, it's the almost a week until the big Chaz and AJ toy drive. They got some problems this year. One of the people who has, you know, always brought a truckload of toys has uh, medical problems, and it's not going to be filling the bill. It's up to us to get a toy. I mean, you got the guy from Grand Funk going to sing. You got the Pink Floyd uh, tribute band going to be there. There's all sorts of, you know, uh, just amazing 
governors and, and well, no, not the governor. He, he, he ain't ever coming to see jazz at AJ again. But you've got mayors, you've got television personalities, and they have all agreed to do really, really embarrassing things. You'll tell about your you tell the, your kids about it around the campfire years from now. So if you can help out, bring an unused new toy or throw down a twenty. We'll take a twenty two. That'll get you in for the big show next Friday. And next Friday, of course, that means your party is gonna start early at like five thirty in the morning. You gotta be ready for it. So you need a good practice weekend right now. Right now. Pig out, pork out, freak out to the best of your ability, my friend, because this weekend is here. It's now, and you've giata, giata, gotta, 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 gotta,